We're here at Late Night Rush with Omar Wyatt, Valdosta defensive lineman and Colorado commit. So, Omar, first off, take me through a bit of your journey year by year, kind of getting to this point. Uh, you know, I great coming out young, really not knowing what's going on. Had a, had a great group. Uh, senior leadership, you know, showed me the, um, the do's and don'ts and how to work. You know, 10th grade, kind of putting it together, having to become a, a, a key player early, you know, playing the big games. And then 11th grade, still the same thing. You know, um, competition, getting better, everybody getting better. You know, you got to try to stay ahead of the, try to stay ahead of the game. And then senior year, you know, just trying to become that leader that my seniors was to me. Gotcha. So going down to Valdosta, how was that experience for you, playing with Eric and all that talent there? You know, it, it's a great thing, you know, playing with somebody, you know, on the other end, just as good as you. It's like a competition every play. Who's going to be the first one there? Who's going to bring to Colorado? For sure. So the decision to go to Colorado, what went through your head? How'd that process go? I, was, I had a, um, a very good relationship with Coach Kelly. And, um, he was at Alabama, and I had a um, very a great relationship with Coach um, Nick from Texas and them. It was, it was either between the two, and I was kind of stuck. And then both of them went to Colorado, so everything just fell in place. And I was, it was a great fit. Gotcha. So Deion Sanders going there, how much did that play into it? What are your thoughts on him being the head coach? You know, that's a, it, it played a lot, you know, seeing him. I've been, you know, I'm a big fan. been watching him on YouTube, seeing how he coaches. You know, he coached college, the college level, the high school. Many people don't know about the high school level. I used to watch that too. You know, he's an interesting guy. So, you know, I just wanted to be a part of something great. For sure. So what was their kind of pitch to you to get you out to Colorado? What did that look like in that relationship? The, the, going back to the relationship I had with um, Coach Kelly and Coach Nick, you know, those guys, those have been solid guys throughout my whole recruitment, you know. They stuck with me, so I'm sticking with them. For sure. And what do you like about them? Like, what makes them kind of stand out as coaches? Coach Nick is just a real guy, you know. And Coach Kelly, you know, he's so truthful. You know, he told me what, like, he came to my spring, he came to a couple of my, my spring practices. He was telling me, hey, you need to get better at this. I like the way you do this. You know, I just got a great relationship with both of those guys. And what do you bring to Colorado? Dominance. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. So break down on tape. What do we see from you? What are those strengths? Quick hands, powerful, sacks. Things, things like that. And what do you like about coming here, coming all the way up to Atlanta to train with Dez and Chuck? What do you like about this and what you take away? You know, I took, I've been taking away a lot. I've been with them since ninth grade. You know, they've been teaching me a lot. You know, I went, I went from what? I went from a season with four or five sacks to a 10 sack season, you know, so I mean, it, it works. For sure. Awesome. And what are your goals for your future? Be great, man. <laughs> for sure. Well, thank you for your time and good luck. Appreciate it.